Linear regression is a great tool for data exploration. It is one of the oldest and most widely used algorithms in data analysis and machine learning. You have some data and you want to be able to build a model that you can use to predict future values. So what you want to do is to build a model that fits your data well and this model is going to be linear. A model is a function that models the relationship between the variables in your data. With linear regression, you can build a linear model that is going to be also called a linear predictor function. Let's look at an example. Here is some sample data. We have three variables, x1, x2 and x3, that we are going to call independent variables and one variable y that we're going to call dependent variable. Our linear model is just going to be a linear polynomial in three variables x1, x2 and x3. In case we have just one variable x, we're going to talk about simple regression. So in the case of simple regression where we have just one uh, independent variable x, we want to find coefficients alpha 0 and alpha 1 that make this function fit our data well, that means that minimize the error. So just some terminology in this equation, x is called the independent variable, sometimes also called explanatory or predictor variable. Y is the dependent variable, sometimes also called target variable. What could these X and Y variables represent? Let's look at an example. X could be, for instance, a city indicator, and Y the profits of your shops. Based on some profits data that you might have already collected, you could use linear regression in order to decide in which city to expand next, in order to maximize your profits. Every time you carry out a data analysis, it's very useful to look at your data first. In this picture, for instance, there does not appear to be any linear relationship between the two variables. So it wouldn't make sense to attempt to find a linear regression model. In this picture, instead, we can see data accumulating along a line. And in fact, here is the result of our linear regression. As you can see, this line seems to fit the data pretty well. Next, we are going to see linear regression in action on real data. For our computations, we are going to use Python 2.7 and three Python libraries, NumPy, Pandas and Matplotlib. So I'm going to open a Python editor and import my libraries NumPy Pandas and Matplotlib PyPlot My data set is a CSV file called ice cream .csv. We can look at it. It contains some data. It's uh, separated by a semicolon. This data contains the amount of sales of ice cream for different temperatures. Let's import this file with read CSV. Read CSV. Separator is um, semicolon. And let's look at this data by issuing and print command. And this is our data. Let's define our variables. X is our independent variable, the temperature y our dependent variable, sales of ice cream, 
Let's look at our data by plotting it. Define some axis labels first. And here is our data. As you can see, the dots are along a line. Let's now compute the coefficient of our regression polynomial with the polyfit function of numpy. And let's compute the polynomial of degree 1. Ys is going to be the array containing the values of the polynomial. And let's look at this polynomial. Let's print it out. And let's look at the coefficients. Finally, let's plot our data together with our linear regression function. As you can see, the linear regression function fits pretty well our data, and we can use it to predict volumes of ice cream sales as dependent on temperatures.